and welcome back to Let's Play Dave the Diver. All right, before we open up for the night, let's put the uh, menu together. All right, first things first. Uh, ooh. I could put this on the menu, but it would be good for Shark Night, so I'm not going to. Instead, we do need to put this on the menu because, uh, what is it, Hot Pepper Tuna? That's what he needs. That's what this guy needs. Let's see here. <clears throat> what else do I want to put on here? Do I want to just burn through my tuna at this point? Oh, wait, I can burn through my marlin. I have so much marlin. Marlin meat, garlic, and miso, sure. Put one of those on the menu. Sweet and sour stargazer. Oh, right, we don't have a ton of eggs, weirdly enough. Uh, I'll have to look into getting some more eggs. All right, what else do I want to put on? Oh, actually, wait. Can I learn any new recipes today? No, I don't have enough flames. Never mind. Uh, more tuna, maybe? Let's no, screw it. I'm going to upgrade this. And I'm just going to make some more tuna. All right, let's put one more thing on there. I think that should be enough. We have two auto supply stuff. I think this should be fine. We have so many dishes. Yeah, we're fine. Staff is good, right? Does anyone need training? Everyone's already out today. Never mind. Uh. Hmm. You know what? No. I think we're good for the night. Let's open up. Okay, so how do I bartend? <laughs> We can bartend now, so I just need to figure out how to do it. Or I could just let Raptor take care of the entire thing. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Are they... Okay, I was going to say, why are they not serving? I think I have to serve him all the way over there at the end. Here you go. Although spicy tuna sounds pretty good, not gonna lie. I think he's cured. Ooh, merchant, you say? So that's the wacky new thing that you unlock? Oh my god, where did you get a truffle? Those things are like, I've seen how, like, how annoying they are to transport and like, ship. They go bad really freaking quickly. Well, I guess we can get truffles on, what, Tuesday, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Okay. <clears throat> and in the afternoon. Oh, I have to remember to come here in the afternoons, apparently. Okay. Oh, right. We're still in the middle of service. I got a truffle and a new recipe. Perfect. Okay, so I need to actually remember to come here during those days to get... What do we get? Looks like recipes and rare ingredients. Got it. Anyways. Oh, God. Cocktail time. Oh, man. No, 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 no. Do not sit there. Hold on. I forgot. I'm still the only one who can clean. I just want to make sure we... Oh, no. She left. Too. Ah, hold on. No. Okay, I definitely need to get someone who knows how to clean. Also, I didn't get to serve anyone a cocktail today. Yeah, I definitely need to get someone to play. We lost two customers because they sat down. I lost three customers because they sat down in a dirty place. Well, hmm. I was kind of hoping I could uh, serve some cocktails today, but I guess not. Oh, 
Apparently, the higher rank you are, the dirtier your customers get. Well, there's always tomorrow to, to like, bartend, I guess. I'm kind of surprised only one person ordered a cocktail all night. It's a new mechanic. You would think they would want more, but, oh well. Okay. Before we head back down, let's go check on the farm and the uh, fish farm. Oh, what day is it today, by the way? Friday? He's not here today. Merchant comes on Saturdays. <laughs> Alright, what's new here? Is it just the last field? Oh no, you're just selling habaneros now. Oh wait, no, there it is. Ooh, 13k. I think I'm actually gonna wait on that one. I'm gonna get some compost though. Let's uh make sure the field is nice and and healthy. That's what I'm looking for. Alright, fields are planted, cleaned up, everything looks good. Let's go check on the fish farm. Something tells me it's gonna be a bit crowded over there. Oh, yeah, I also have money. Let me see if I can upgrade my equipment. Oh, my God. You guys were busy. You guys were very busy. Oh, my God. Actually, you know what? Hold on. No, I'm trying to... Why can't I upgrade? There we go. I'm going to expand all the areas a little bit. This might cost me an upgrade, but I think it's worth it. Okay. So let's start cleaning out the area a little bit. At this point, I don't need blue tangs. Those you I remember way all the way back at the beginning of the game where those are like my main thing I sold at the restaurant. And now we're like we've gone so far from there. Kind of impressive to be honest. Uh okay, we have room. We still have room here, but let me just get ahead of things. Just want to make sure we don't run out of room really quickly. Plenty of room here. These are all going to the kitchen because that is a shark. Technically, I think. Pretty sure that's a shark, right? Eight breeding pairs here. I have breeding pair of Haddock and Arctic Cod. Everything else, though, is still only one. Same here. I barely have any fish in that area. That's a lot more eels. Ooh, that's a lot of copper sharks. Okay, so we do have a breeding pair of sharks, so that's good. So I guess we're heading down to the Sea People Village to ask about the whole slab thing. Before I go down, I did finish these. How much more until I actually can upgrade this? I feel like I haven't upgraded this in, like, ages. When was the last time I actually got an upgrade with my research? Because this is just something I've been doing on the side. Which is probably why I haven't actually gotten enough points to get to the next level for a while. Oh, also. Hot tuna. We're going to like that. Nice tuna steak. Oop. Like that. Like that. Alright, let's go. Oh, actually, one last thing. Anything good? O2. Oh, wait, I forgot to upgrade my equipment, too. Uh, that's fine. I'll save my money for now. You never know. I might need to, like, hire a ton of people. Also, where did my list... Of okay, I was gonna say, where did all my missions go? 
Let's see here. We got ourselves a quest at the seed shop. I need to go to the temple and then uh, I'll check my fields. Actually, you know what? While I'm here, hold on. I can make this a bit quicker. Never gonna say no to more movement speed. Alright, what do you need? Seaweed seeds. Wait, don't we already have those? Oh, um, alright, free seeds for me, nice. Oh, as in seaweed as in the general, like, overall things you can grow there, not just specifically seaweed. Because that is a crop and also describes all of the things we grow. It's a little confusing. Wrong thing. Here, while I'm here, let's just go see what they have to say about that slab we found. So apparently it's a spell, which makes me really hope that Dave gets to be a wizard. It would make no sense in con- well no, it could make some uh, sense in context, but it'd be a bit of a weird twist. Oh, you. Uh, I guess we've seen one of them, right? So we need to get to the control room, which is a weird thing to say. Why does the tree have a- I guess it's like monitoring the tree. From what we've heard about it so far. Do I have to? Well, I guess we're doing this. Uh, can we hurry this up? I sense danger. Oh no. <laughs> ah, so it was not part of it. Of course. Well, let's get in there. You know what, before we go in, hold on a second. I have one narware, narware, narwhal row. Let me, uh, let me see if I can get another one. Also, I'm gonna use this. Up you go. Alright, so anyways, now that I take care of that, I'll take that. Let's grab some O2 and then uh, head in, see what's in there. Can't be that bad, right? What's the worst that could happen? Ooh, do I want... Mm. I'm gonna be switching areas soon, so I should probably not put a crab trap down immediately. Maybe on the way back, we'll put something down. Oh, it looks exactly the same as the Glacial Passage. I was kind of hoping it would be new. Not a big fan of the ice, uh, aesthetic. Wait. Uh, hold on a second. Am I dumb? Wait. I thought he said he could do it himself, right? Oh, I have to literally push on it with my face. I thought I had to actually interact with it. Nope. This seems easy enough to dodge. Okay, maybe I spoke a little too soon. Oh, 
Oh, wait. Is this what I think it is? Hold on. Yep, it's what I think it is. It's one of these puzzles. I don't know the exact name of these puzzles, so... It looks like what we have to do is we basically need to rotate things so that... Oh, wait. Can I not get out of here? Oh, I guess I can't get out of here. Oh, wait. No, I can just go over. I'm dumb. Listen, some things in this game are 2D and some, like, are on the 2D plane and some aren't. It's hard to tell sometimes. Okay. So I think we need to rotate that one a bit more to the right. Yeah, we need to rotate that one. Okay. Is it this? Hold on. Try going the other way. I think that's good. Because it should just go all the way to the right now and then go down the center, right? Okay, no, that worked. Also, I think I saw an oxygen clam over here. Oh yeah, there is one. Let me uh, fill up. Never be too careful. Especially down here. Oh, right. I forgot to upgrade my knife. I also did not mean to hit that. Right? Yeah, I still need to upgrade my knife. Oh, wait. These things are hostile. Or at least this specific one is hostile for some reason. It's an Arctic Telescope fish, huh? Have I gotten you yet? I don't know. You're too far away. Maybe I should consider bringing my net gun. Well, hmm. I don't know if I would want to bring my net gun considering how many sharks are down here. Oh, do we have to, yeah, we have to match the, um, the position in the mural. I see now. So, let me see here. Also, this puzzle's a little weird because Dave can't swim into the background. This is very clearly supposed to be like a 3D puzzle, but... Okay, so, we need his head facing to the left. I think that's right. The hand on the top might be a bit weird. Uh, hold on. Is this angle right? Needs to be a bit lower. Actually, no, that looks right. It's this hand that's kind of weird. Because an arm should, the arm should not be bending like that, I feel. So I think we have to rotate a little bit more. Okay, um, hold on a minute. Head won't turn anymore. Okay, no, that's way too far up. That's way too far down. Okay, that looks right, right? Hold on a second. Does he be a bit higher? No, that's too far. Oh, there we go. Got it. I guess the arm just wasn't at the correct angle. Alright, so it looks like that's one out of three locks down. Two more to go. How do I get to the other two? Yeah, we've definitely hit the point of, of these type of games where it just kind of dissolve, it devolves into, like, puzzles.
I think we just blew his mind. Alright, I think we're done then. Uh, let's get out of here. Oh, actually, before we go back, I kind of want to go set a quick crab trap. Just so that we have something to bring back with us. Oh, I should also get some more O2. Okay, before I go up, um, let's set a quick trap. Sure, we'll put this in. I guess that's the only fish I have right now. Actually, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Might have been good to bring that back with me instead. Alright, uh, we'll wait a few seconds. There should be more sharks down here, right? Because I feel like this is the one area where it doesn't really randomize every time we come down. The layout has been pretty much the same every single time. What is that? Hold on a second, that's new. An ice gun. Okay, maybe it's not completely randomized, or not completely unrandomized. Hold on, I need to find something to use this thing on. So, from the description, hold on, let me read the description again. Um, freezes, or fires frost bullets, stack coldness of freeze target, and then follow up with attacks from other weapons. Got it. So basically, freeze them and then go in and smack them. Okay, I need to try this out on something. Where is that shark? There's usually one down here. What the heck? Okay, I am just doing an ice build at this point, so... Oh, perfect. So it looks like I basically try to freeze it, and then probably use my, uh... My harpoon gun out. Oh, I see. Oh, we can actually shoot it in burst, too. Perfect. Oh, no, no, no. Frozen, smack. Oh, okay, so that's how it works. Okay. Uh. I don't know how I feel about that one. I can see it being good. Well, I guess it is actually pretty good. I don't know, I feel like that one with some upgrades could be a pretty good uh, gun to use. Aside my heart, with, uh, along with my harpoon gun. Okay. Okay, aiming is a little bit awkward, though. Because once you, uh, you've locked into position, you can only fire in that one area. Unlike other guns where it's just kind of one shot. It's good against, like, big, really slow stationary targets. Against more nimble ones? I don't know. I'm gonna have to play around with it more. But I did not expect to get a brand new gun this late in the game. Anyways, let me go grab my uh, fish trap. Don't want flames. Yeah, sure, it does more damage. Guess it doesn't have the splash damage, though, is the problem. Okay, anyways, like I was saying, let me go grab my crab trap, and then we'll head back to the village. There's a mirror right to the south of us. Got multiple crabs in that. Nice. Where did that mirror go? This seems like another area we're going to need to go to later. Because there are three of them. I'm thinking this one, the one to the lower left, are the ones we need to go to. Oh, I guess there was another block passage we also saw earlier. Let's see what the sea people have to say about all this. Oh, 
Oh, also before I go up, uh, let me also go check on my crops. Hello there! I can buy new seeds. Was it black coral, southern bull kelp, and um, buck beans? I feel like I haven't actually found any buck beans, so I'm actually going to grab all of these. And I think I'm going to grow those next. Because, yeah, I don't think I've actually gotten any yet. Or if I have, I haven't been paying attention. library time. Also, did Swamp just leave us behind again? I guess in this case there was no danger, so it wasn't really a problem, but it feels like every time we take him somewhere, he just goes off on his own. Also, I think there was a warp point to the right. Oh wait, uh, wrong person. I meant to go to the palace, apparently. I just defaulted to library. I probably should have paid attention to both the name and the uh, marker. <laughs> Hello, Tenzin. Yep, I... Okay, that's one solution to doing that. Yeah, this seems like a really... That seems like a really dumb idea, not gonna lie. Okay, so yeah, basically what's happening is it sounds like the control room isn't controlling things properly, and it's causing the local oceans to overheat, which is just completely destroying the ecosystem. Okay. So two more rooms until we can get down there. Uh, it seems like that's everything I can do for now. So I think I'm going to head back up to the surface for now. See if there are any new developments up there. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Wait, the beluga used to f uh, travel around faster? Ooh. Considering how important that thing seems, maybe we should have closed the door behind us. This is like leaving your door open and your cat gets out. Okay, um, I guess we're gonna have to find the beluga. Alright, I think I'm going to find him next time, though. I want to head back up to the surface for now. Do a couple of uh, maintenance things. Also, see if I can upgrade my knife. Because I completely forgot about upgrading my knife. And it's starting to become annoying. Because I can't harvest any of the ores. Because the game has stopped giving me uh, pickaxes. Oh, I actually went through that too quickly. I didn't see if I got any, uh, shark row. Who the heck are you? No, no, no. It's too late in the game to be, introdu be introducing wacky new mini game or wacky new side activity c characters. Uh, have I? I guess we haven't seen any great whites, huh? Yeah, we, we've noticed that. Okay, so I was gonna go find the beluga that the sea people need to, like, help maintain their infrastructure. But this old lady in a raft just asked me to go hunt down a shark. 
So I should probably go do that. If it's only during stormy nights, yeah, I should definitely do that today then. Time to go and enact revenge. Wait, do I actually have to do that today? Stor oh, it's a nighttime thing? Okay, never mind. Um, that's a nighttime mission. We'll do that tonight then. Alright, but with that, I think we're going to wrap things up here then. So, next time on Let's Play Dave the Diver, I'm just going to double check that that's a nighttime mission. If it is, we're going to go back down to the glacial area and try to find that beluga. If it's not, we're going to go hunt down a shark. Actually, honestly, we're probably going to do both next time. So, till then.